Okay, it's just you and me, me and you. That's amazing. <laughs> How was your day, Janet? Was it, it was a day so tired. Really? Yeah, you look like that. You look like you want to sleep. Yes, I or want to sleep, yeah. Or do you have a headache? No. No. I, I had a headache uh, in the morning. Oh, that's why. Because your eyes tell me something. Yeah. Your eyes are a little... Uh, the uh, are the office... One. Yeah, the, the office was too, too tired. Wow, I can imagine that. Wow, it was really stressful, right? Yes, but I closed the, the project that, that my boss gave me. Mm -hmm. And all, almost I, I can rest a little off tomorrow. Yay, that was amazing. Well, I'm so happy and I thank you so much for being in class, even though you feel tired. You're welcome. No, yeah, don't worry if you want like to sometimes turn it off the camera because you want to close your eyes. That would be okay for me. Okay, don't worry about that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thanks. You know what? Now you are wearing as something kind of similar to what Miss Jenny is wearing right now. Right yes. now, Jenny and hey. you. Hey, this is a baby. <laughs> Hi, baby boy. How are Hi, you? Teacher. Hey, we have a new student. Hi. <laughs> Hello. How are ya? Hi, Hi teacher. Hey. Hi. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay. Somebody. Hey. Hey. I have a baby as well. But it's a little bit bigger. Hi. Okay. Let me, okay. Who's this? Hey. <laughs> Hi. Okay, let's close the door. Hey. I'm baby. Hey. Where's the baby? Oh, oh, there's a baby. Hey. Where's the baby? Oh, there you go. You see? You <laughs> got Hi. Okay. Hola. Hi, hola. <laughs> Hi. Hi, hi, hi. Hey. Hey, how are you? Hey. <laughs> I love babies. I love kids. <laughs> I used to be a, 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 a kids teacher, so I, I love them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're Say, really teacher. cute. Yeah, I like it. I love them. It's really, yeah. I know. I'm so, I congratulate you, Jenny, because it's not easy to be a mom. Thank you. Or, and also to be here. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm okay if the kids are here. I love them. Hmm, don't worry about that. <laughs> don't worry for me. Yeah, of course. And today you look different. You are in a different part of your house, right? Yes. Yeah, it's yeah. It's yeah. yeah, that's nice. Hey, and there's, and there's a baby. And there's like, oh no, wait, wait a minute. You have another baby. Your dog uh -huh. is in the back, right? Do you have a dog? Yeah. Yes. He was like this, like, hello. <laughs> yeah, he was on the back. Yeah, yes. I, I saw his little face. <laughs> It's a brown color one, right? Brown color? Is it brown? It's, yes. It's nay. It's nay. is dulce. Dulce. Oh, like sweetie. Oh, that's nice. So it's a girl. Yes. Oh, how old is she? Uh, so, uh, only. Only one, uh, one year? See, one dog. Okay. I, I think your husband was asking, he was saying like, honey, 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 right? Was, yes. Was your husband honey, honey, honey? Yeah, you see, I know that. <laughs> okay, you know what? <laughs> the word honey, let me let you know. Now, 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 I remember that because I listened, I think it was your husband, right? Saying that to the little baby boys. And um, the word honey, of course, right? Is the, the syrup that the bees create for us, right? Of course, but also depends of the context. Is a word that can, you can use with your Siendo. with your babies, like your Siendo. husband is, is uh, using it right now. Also, he can use it with you, right? Like the way to treat you, like honey, like oh my god, like like a princess. <laughs> but at the same time, also uh, you can use it with your girlfriends. 
For example, let's pretend that Janet, Jenny, and, and Eo, they are friends, right? They are girlfriends and all the stuff. And you say, hey, honey, how you doing? You see, you can call between you. You can call, honey, not but 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 Sirhan and Carlitos and Carlitos they cannot use honey between them no way no 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 you can use honey if you're um talking with your girlfriend with your uh, baby girl or with your wife right oh, include include included also with your sister but between the guys you cannot call you honey but with, with girls between girls yes we can call honey. You see, you see how, how we can use it in context as well? Have you ever have you ever heard that used before? The word honey that we can use it between girls, yeah? Or for you, Jenny, is the first time. Mm. The word honey first. the first time? See, si, first yeah. time. Okay, so now you know that you can use Honey, when you're talking about uh, your your husband with your babies, but at the same time, you can say honey to your girlfriends as well, okay? But no Carlito, Carlos Antonio, and Sirhan, please. I don't want to listen to you say honey between you because it's not good. Hey, you can say, hey, man. Oh, no, you know what? Uh, Sirhan, uh, Carlitos, Carlitos Cruz, and Boris, you can say, what's up, Doug? <laughs> you can say you can call you can call between yeah Doug what's up Doug hey Doug hey, yeah it, I, oh my god <laughs> I was not talking about you like Doug no you know what yeah <laughs> and girls you can you can say Doug if you're referring to a boyfriend okay but friend no boyfriend boyfriend mm -hmm. is like your honey right boyfriend mm -hmm. is a friend but is a masculine sex okay so you can also call it hey Duke but it's more um, common that the guys uh, treat each other hey what's up Duke hey Duke because that's the other way to say guy or boy okay so hey guy hey Duke is Duke is your you're you're together right your girlfriend hey Duke what's up Duke remember Bugs Bunny what's up Duke <laughs> Yeah, mm -hmm. all right. So you learned another two words that you can also use in a different context, okay? Okay, let me ask you, can uh, can the boys use honey to treat them, to talk between boys, between men? Can they use word, the word honey? No. Yeah. Can you give me an example how you can use the word honey, Ew? with who? With my mom. Mm -hmm. With my best friend, with my boyfriend, mm -hmm. yes, <laughs> and with my baby. Yeah, exactly. And with your husband, uh -huh. you already have yes. a, like in the case of Jenny and Janet. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. And also, Mr. Sirhan mm -hmm. and Carlitos, they can also use honey when they're talking with their uh, with their uh, wives, or if my you wife. have a, like a baby girls. You can also yeah. use the word honey, okay? Mm -hmm. Or if you have a sister as well, because it's just yeah. it's for family purposes, okay? All right, excellent. So you learned a new word. Hey, guys. Hey, how was the day so far? Thank you, uh, 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 bodies. No. Hello, really? tell, yes, tell us a little bit about yourself. How was your day today? Um, very busy. Really, what's and, up? Um, yeah, uh, meaning, meaning by meaning. Okay. Uh, all days in home office. Wow. It's very boring, but um, mm -hmm. that's the job. In, I know, that's the job. It's good. I got a job. <laughs> yes, you got a job. Exactly. Oh my God, very busy. What uh, do you um? You, you said that you're working from home office. Is that right? Yes. All yes. righty. I am in home office. In home office. What is exactly what you do? Um, uh, I'm planning the project uh, for uh, DC. DC. 
in Costa Rica. Oh, really? Oh, where my yeah, sister uh, lives. Distribution yes. center of oh. Costa Rica. Oh, okay, Costa Rica distribution center. That's amazing. Yes. But in the main San Jose or in a different province? Mm, near San Jose. Near Alajuela. Uh, Alajuela, yes. I know yeah. where is Alajuela. Mm -hmm. I, yeah. Oh, that's not, I love that. Place. Another another uh, DC uh, bakery. Bakery? Okay. Uh, yes. Uh, I think you you say bakery equals uh, abarrotes. Uh, no, that is like a grocery store. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, the this other dis distribution center mm -hmm. uh, is in um ouch uh, yeah uh, <laughs> I knew it. Yes. You see, because my I sister like... li li used to live in Kuridabad. That's the reason why I know that. Yeah, yeah. It's Thirty I, minutes from I, the airport. I like, I like this this weather. Uh, that oh weather. yeah. Oh no. You know what? I rem <laughs> I remember. I was like, it was like three years ago that I was there because my sister got married, and uh, I had to be there with my mom to um, take care of my niece while they were on the honeymoon. So uh, basically, I think it was around April, but the uh, the no the last date of March, the first date of April. I remember that. And my sister used to live in a place where there is like a near plantation of like yeah. a, like a huge trees that you use for yeah. Christmas purposes. So basically, you cannot imagine. Uh, everybody, right? Everybody, like in the morning, really early morning, the first thing that you do is to go to the bathroom, for example. Okay, but you want to go to the bathroom, and to be honest with you. I, I wanted, but I didn't want it at the same time because we were like seven Celsius degrees. Oh, that's and cold. I was like, Ugh. and I yeah, asked my, my niece, like hey, baby, word. yeah. She said, Auntie, what happened? I want to go to the bathroom. Okay, so, so, so go. No, why not? Because it's really cool and I don't want to get up. Yeah, <laughs> cool. yeah. Can you imagine seven thousand degrees? Oh, yes. no way. Yes. Yeah. So for me here, like 18, 19 or 15 is really good. But I, I put a sweater on when I feel like the weather, like in 11, 11 Celsius degrees. Now it's good. Yes. 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 I love it. I love it. But now she moved. I love too. She she lives she used to live near Cahuita, uh, Limon. Ah, Limon. Limon, yes. Uh, Atlantic uh, side. Exactly. You know what, guys? In Limon is where they the uh, they film on Jurassic Park. In Limon. Mm -hmm. But it's really really hot. It's like I living did. in the in the um, Liberty. I didn't know that. Yeah. Now you know it. <laughs> yes. Yeah. It's really nice. Oh, so that's good. So basically, you have been busy, really busy. Yeah. Well, but I'm so uh, happy that days, you're here. Days uh, like like uh, today, mm -hmm. very busy. Other days, uh, not no not no too more. busy. No, not too busy. Okay. I think Janet wanted to to have a really relaxed day. Yeah. Yeah, because Janet has been really Other. busy as you. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think everybody. Thank you, Boris, for sharing, okay? Okay, okay. Anytime that you would like to know any place for Costa Rica, ask me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All righty, very I good. Will. Yeah, thank you. And hopefully you you, um, you have a really success in your project, okay? Thank you. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Okay, you can continue working, okay? Don't worry about me. Um, let me check. Who else? Who else? Stephanie. Ramirez, okay, we haven't heard for you since like two days ago, so it's now is your time to speak. Go ahead, girl. How you feel? You feel much better? Yeah, I feel hey, better. Hey, that's amazing. Hey, Thank tell you. us. Hey, how was your day? It was okay. Okay, that's nice. What did you do? Um, in the morning, I I was doing the dishes. Oh, you wash the dishes. Okay. Yeah, and in the afternoon I, I, I worked. You worked. Okay. 
So today was a part-time job. You only work in the afternoon? Yes, I have a part-time job. Hey, that's amazing. I wish I could have a part-time <laughs> job. Really? Yes, yes, I did. So, yeah, oh, that's amazing. How long have you been in that part-time job? I'm sorry? How long have you been working in the part-time job? Um, from 2 p.m. Um, to 5.30. 5.30. <gasps> so that means Sometimes. three hours and a half. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, but I mean, I mean, how long have you been working there? One year, two years, three years? Um, do you understand my question? Six, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Six okay. months around. Oh, six months around. Uh, you said that you uh, you work in a in like a shopping center or right? something like that. No. Um, no, I'm assistant in a private clinic. Oh, oh, that's why that's amazing. A private <laughs> clinic. That's great. Oh, so you know how to shop? No, no. <laughs> no. Uh, well, yes, I know I'm how assistant. to shot uh, animals. So I shot my babies. But no human beings. That's another thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, but that's nice. Hey, your job is really interesting, and yeah. I like it. Only three hours and a half daily. That's amazing. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> yes, I know. I envy you. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? One of the things that I love to give classes that I can go anywhere, any place, and I'll always be with you. <laughs> so maybe, guys. I don't know. Maybe next time I will be in Costa Rica. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm giving you classes from there. <laughs> Wait, yeah, that's amazing. With all the puppies around me, because my sister had like four puppies and one cat and a lot of chickens. <laughs> Can you imagine? Yes, and Hanks. Yes. So, well, I will share. I will share um, a phone, some photos of where she lives. Okay, so you can have an idea. Hey guys, talking about that. Eh, thank you so much for your homework. Hey, let's listen to your homework, right? I remember that some of you were supposed to send a homework. And I have here two participants, okay? I have Carlos Antonio Polanco and Carlos Cruz, okay? So I think, eh, Carlos Antonio, you receive an email from Carlos Cruz, is that right? Is that correct? Yes, it's correct. Okay, could you please be so kind to read it for us his email? Wait. I wait. Wait a moment, please. Okay. Read it like the way it is, okay? Literally the way it is. And I, I have no sent it to all of you that corrections and everything because I'm gonna send it to you after this class, okay? If somebody wants to know teacher, I, if I don't that correctly, if everything is correct, I'm not gonna say anything until we finish today's class. Okay, so don't worry. But I'm so happy that you did your best. That's really good. Did hey. you find it? <laughs> hey. Okay. Car okay, cool. Okay, Carlos, listen. Uh, yes. Just read it. Read it like the way it is. The beach of the del Tunco. Okay. Yes, read it. Re read, read the email. Ah, oh, really? Okay. Yes. Hi, Carlos Polanco. This was my last vacation. I went to play El Tunco from La Libertad, El Salvador. The beach is a beauty, a great place for surfing. The weather was good, some all day and the food was delicious. <laughs> it was a fun day for me and my family. See you soon. All right, very good, excellent. Great job. I, and Carlitos Cruz, do you receive an email from Carlitos Antonio? Yes. Okay, now yes. is your time to read it. Um, okay. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. Hi, Carlos. I spent my holiday with my family in Discovery. I was oh. great. My dad and I like to fish. My okay. father catch a lobster, three fish, about 40 centimeters. Really? Uh -huh. I Continue. was incredible. <laughs> Those, those as, as that's a rock, 
uh, that you see in the postcard, and I catch one uh, of, of, of five centimeters. Okay. That's what <laughs> found. You're the better than each one and you're like, oh my God. <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. The time spent with my family was good. Uh, I see you some. Hey, that was nice. Very good. That was an amazing story, <laughs> Carlitos Antonio. Your father is yeah. an expert fisherman, but you... He fishes. <laughs> but you just, just a tiny one. <laughs> Oh, uh, but but, but I think that was really fun experience. Yes. Yeah, it's really good. Oh, and also, oh, oh, uh -huh. all day the the you you say, <laughs> the net of the water. Uh -huh. uh, only one fish, my father. <laughs> oh was, my, he was uh, the winner. Uh, yeah. Also, the lo a lobster. You said right, a lobster. Oh, lobster. oh amazing! And do you Great. cook them? Great dinner. Of course. <laughs> Amazing. Congratulations. Very good job. Okay. That was really nice. Excellent. All right. And let me check. Ale, Ew, you work with who? Okay, don't worry. Don't worry. Okay, I think there's we're missing guys right, right now, right? Okay, don't worry about it. What I want you to do is just read your email, guys, and we are going to guess who wrote that email to Alejandra, okay? Okay, listen, okay, read it for us, please. Okay, can you hear me? Yes, we can. Okay, okay. Hi, I hope you are very well. I had a wonderful time. If you look at the picture below, you will know, you will know where is I was. Exactly, I was at the sea, specifically in San I had a very pleasant time with my family. We stayed in some cabins by the sea. We walked along the beach and we, we sound in the pool. Mm -hmm. As though it was not for long, it was relaxing to rest and we forgot the daily stress. Mm -hmm. How was your vacation? Tell me, I would like to know what it you did. We love Janet. Hey, don't say it. <laughs> But that I'm was really okay, okay. Let's return back. Okay, now we're gonna do that. That's okay. <laughs> Excellent job. That was amazing. Oh my god. And that's the first thing that I told her not to say. <laughs> oh come on. No, that's okay. Don't worry. That was the, the fun part of the story. That was amazing. Hey, what incredible vacation, Janet. <laughs> I like it. You know what? I am trying to consider this. But that was before the quarantine, right? Oh, yeah. 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 The beach is really nice. Very good. I love the beach, especially the seafood. Mm. <laughs> All right. Now, Janet, it's your turn. But please don't say who sent it to you. We're going to guess. Okay. <laughs> Read it for us, please, girl. Okay. Hi, Janet. Thanks for... Thanks for your letter. It's nice to hear from you. Sounds looks like a good place. I'm glad to enjoy it with your family. By the way, I had a wonderful trip in Honduras. I went with I went with my best friend's family and we stayed in a hotel in Copan for two years. Ooh. For two day, day. Uh, for your two years, like how much money? Two she days. <laughs> Okay, continue. Here she lived here. Yes, you scared me. <laughs> we visited the ruins uh -huh. and, and of the of this place, and we ate traditional food. It was an unforgettable experience, and I'm ready to visit to visit another country. Anyway, that's my news. I hope you're very well. Best wishes hey, i'm oh. sending you a photo with my best friends hey that's nice thank you hey girls and boys and guys who do you think sent that email to janet uh-huh any ideas just one of the time please don't fight between you yes one at a time i know everybody wants to participate yes all your horses <laughs> uh huh. Sirhan, any idea? Uh, 
I don't know. Who do you think sent that email to Janet? Was it Stephanie? Was it Jenny? Was it Boris? Was it other Stephanie? Was it Eu? I don't know. Who do you think? Or was somebody else? I don't know. No idea, sir. Eu. Eu. Aha. Uh -huh. Is it, it was Eu? Was it Eu? Janet? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Uh, 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 um. All right. Sirhan, now it's your turn. Could you please be so kind to read us your email? Okay. It's from Alexander. I don't say it. That's okay. Uh, uh, yes, he's not here. Okay. Okay. He said, Hi, Alexander. Who are you? It's been a long time sign from the last mail. Mm -hmm. I have to tell you, the last summer I was the vacation at a beautiful beach located in the department the our country, exactly in Union Department. Take about three hours to arrive, but wow. worry it. The sun is black because probably the volcano eruption. Uh -huh. the, weather, the weather is very warm, but for this warm, I carry a cooler with some drinks. Hey, 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 I read it now. Uh huh. <laughs> the, food, the food is spectacular. I, I ate a big fried fish with rice and salad. In this beach, there is a no wave and the sea like a big pool. Really? And the sunset, yes. And the sunset is amazing. The sunshine, of, as i the last performance, but I was only a couple of days because I needed to get home as soon possible because Neron is staying alone. Neron is my new dog. Ah, okay. Okay, my friend, I hope <laughs> the... <laughs> okay, my friend, I hope the next vacation you can join me. Rigor, see him. Hey, that was really nice. You know what? In the middle of when you were telling us all oh, the whole soap opera, <laughs> your vacation is here. <laughs> yeah, I was imagining everything, especially the cooler part, you know, the drinks and everything. That, oh, yeah, and, and the fire fish and everything, the salad. It's, 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 yeah. it's soda, soda, soda. I, no, no, no I, I'm, soda. Not, I'm not asking about what kind of beverages. No, of course. <laughs> no, but I was imagining the whole thing, you know. Hey, that was amazing. And, you know, you said something that is really nice, like, it, it was supposed to be a beach, right? But there were no waves. Looks like a pool. What is the name of that beach? Tamarindo Beach. Oh, the Tamarindo, tamarindo one? Tamarindo Beach. Ah, didn't yeah. know that. It, it, um, it, hey, it, it, that it, sounds beach. really good. Really? It's Better it, than it, El it, Espino? It, 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 oh, okay. Uh, it's similar, but the oh, Tamarindo similar. is the best. Uh -huh. Okay. The, the sun is playing, playing. You walk at uh, 50, 50 meters. Uh, so you can get into the water meters. and walking. Yeah, really? Yeah. Oh my God, that's yes. nice. Hey, you know, I think I will visit it. There you go. That's <laughs> nice. Yeah, wow. Yeah, so yeah, exactly. That's why you compare like a pool, right? Yeah, it was nice. And you know what is really, I really like, I don't know about you girls and boys, but I really like when you said um, that the color of the sand, because it's for a volcano. So normally the color of the sand is like kind of brownie, but you said that it was kind of like a pear for me, like a black one, right? Black color. Wow, it's the interesting. Truly, I like, I, 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 I like the old beaches because uh -huh. the sun is black. Wow, that, yes, and I think it's because of the volcano thing, mm -hmm. definitely. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. It, it will be really good to do like a fit spa, right? Mm -hmm. mm, excellent, very good, interesting. Thank you so much, sir, that was amazing. Hey, let me check, Steffi, who do you work with? Oh, no, no, no. yeah, who sent it to you, the, the email? Don't say it, okay, just read it for us. I received Jenny's email. Ay, why? Okay, don't. It, I think it, it, nobody like listen or pay attention when I say don't say it, who sent it to you. That's okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, Steffi. Hey, sh share with us Jenny's vacation. And imagine in vacation because she said I had been like one more than one year without vacation. So, okay, go ahead. 
okay. Uh, she said, hello, Stephanie. I'm happy to write this email for you. In, this, in, in the year, I wasn't in the vacation, but I had a lot, a lot of fun with my children and my husband. We watched movies in series. Our favorite series is Doctor House. Hey, it's I like it. <laughs> it's very good. Mm -hmm. We cleaned our house and it was really nice working together. We want to visit in the next vacation, Chalatenango, Santa Teresa. Oh. It is a beautiful place. Yeah. It's a root flower. Um, Right. I like mm -hmm. I like writing this email piece for you. Oh. And that's it. That's it. A very good. That was interesting. Yeah. Do you love the road flower? I love it. It's amazing. Yes, that is one of my favorite places. I love cold weather, but I love seafood. <laughs> so, it's, so it's like a combination of both. Very good. That was nice. Excellent. Great job. Jenny, and I imagine, right? I imagine that you receive an email from Stephanie, right? <laughs> but no. No. But no. You say, you With say somebody yesterday, else. I sent you the email uh, Esmeralda, but she's not here. She's not here. Ah, okay. Okay, so now, Jenny, okay, that's okay. No problem. Okay, so in this case, let's listen to Jenny, okay? Jenny, what about you? What is the email that you receive? Uh, no. Nobody sent you an email? No. Oh, <laughs> nobody. Mm. Oh, no. Poor Jenny. I thought that was a Steffi. Hey. <laughs> okay, so in this case, let me check. Boris, you're going to do me a favor. Boris? Yeah. After this class, please send an email to Jenny about your vacation, okay? Okay, to Jenny. To Jenny. Jenny, uh, Gloryville, Novasco, Quijada, right? Quijada, yes. Okay, pronounce it correctly. Yay! You have to congratulate me. I'm proving my Spanish. Come on. Oh, my vacation, <laughs> yes, exa yeah, va? Yes, yeah, va? like, oh, va, I like that one. <laughs> yes, exactly, Boris. The Salvadorian <laughs> terms. Yeah, but you know what? It's really nice. But we are really complicated sometimes. I remember the, a word that says voladito. Voladito. Yeah. But voladito could be a lot of things, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. So voladito could be like this one. Voladito could be this one. That depends on the context. Or for example, you said a chunche. And I was like, what's chunchito. <laughs> yeah. Like, what's that? Like, oh, cuenterete. Like, what's that? Come on. <laughs> and I was like, okay, writing, writing, writing. Okay. I, you know, I have like a huge book with all the definitions <laughs> because, oh my God. A pie, a piate. Oh, what is the other one? Mm. Utualito. What else? Other? <laughs> oh, okay, I, I I don't remember one, but I love it. I, I, that is um one term that the old people used to say. I'm go, I'm going to remember. If I remember, I will let you know. If not, I'm going to write it to you, okay? Because sometimes I, I just remember when I heard it. But you know what's okay. really nice because I want to know what you're talking about, right? Very good. Okay, so you're going to send it to Jenny after the class, okay? Hey, um, hey it is my turn. It's my turn. I'm gonna, I'm gonna read it to you, okay? Well, I had to let you know, guys, that the, the uh, it is a girl. Um, but she's not here. Hopefully, we'll enjoy the class later on. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna read it to you, and I'm not gonna say who wrote it to me, okay? Huh. Huh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna read it to you like the way it is. Okay, I'm not going to ban anything now because that's I'm I'm just evaluating a lot of things. Okay, that's okay. Okay, said hello, teacher. How are you? Hope all is okay. I want to share with you how was my last vacation before the quarantine. I went with my whole family to a place called Samuk Champagne, Guatemala. The meaning of this name is something like when the river hides under the stones. 
This place is called this because at this point of the river, there is a huge hole when the river disappears and appears ahead after too many waterfalls and stones. So it is an amazing show to see how much water is inside the earth. And the name of the river is Cajabon, but I don't know the meaning of that. In this place, there are small pools for swimming and caves with other waterfalls. Then we jump off a huge swim and fell into the middle of the river. It was funny, but painful because I felt bad and hurt myself in the legs, but nothing too dangerous. The weather was too hot. This surprised me because in general, Guatemala is cold. Another attraction in this place is a lookout from the top of the mountain to see the river. It's beautiful because the different pools have different shades of green, but not 50. <laughs> That's what she said. Well, I hope that you want to share uh, me how were your last vacation before of the quarantine to send you a lot of huge hugs, sorry, and kisses. Have a nice afternoon. A, hey, who do you think wrote it to me? Loida. Ah, my goodness. Yeah. Why you said that? Is she, is she, sir, Han? Because uh, yesterday, say, say uh -huh. the, 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 the vacation. Uh -huh. Oh, she, she, she talked about in, that. In yeah. yeah she she talked about that. She talked about that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, that was easy, right? <laughs> Okay, very good. Hey, who was missing? Nobody? Everybody already participated? Yeah, right? Okay, cool. Hey, how was this exercise? Do you like it? Was it good? Okay, yeah, yeah I like it. Okay, I'm, okay. Um, I have uh, received some of your emails. Okay, I'm just double checking it right now, but I'm still missing some of you guys. So please send it to me because I'm gonna double check them as well. And then I will let you know where areas you need to improve and all the stuff, okay? This will be like evaluating like uh, one in one session. All right. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. You did an excellent job. Now guys, hey, for, with this exercise, definitely we finished the topic that we have been seeing so far, which is simple past, okay? Now guys, we are going to start a new topic. Back, let me ask you something. Uh, do you remember the first time that you arrived to your neighborhood? Do you remember the first time, the first night, that when you arrived to where you live right now and you, you don't even know the places around you, if there were like a cafeteria, a supermarket, a shopping center, a barber shop, you, you felt like, oh my God, right? I need to know this and this and this, but I don't know where are them. So you start asking, right, your neighbors, hey, do you know by any chance eh, where is the near gas station? Where is the near supermarket and all the stuff? Okay. So basically this uh, model or this unit is going to talk about that, your neighborhood. Okay. And uh, we're going to learn the new words. There are some words that you already know, talking about places, right? And, but also we're going to make like a, re a little reminder about how you said I in, in English, but no, I like, ouch, no. I like, I, no, that is ouch. When somebody like kick you and you're like, in, in Spanish or in El Salvador, you said I, right? <laughs> I for having and I for pain, right? But in English, no. If you're like, that is ouch, okay? Ouch. But, it, well, but if you're talking about an existence of something, you're going to use there is for single things and there are for more than one. Okay? There is one. There are many. There are some when you're talking about plural. Or if you're, if you're seeing or if you know that there's nothing for example, you now I'm just looking for a supermarket, but there is no supermarket, right? So there aren't any supermarkets near your house. That means that you cannot find even one. 
Okay, we're going to get into deep on that later on, may tomorrow. Okay, don't worry about that. Right now, let me share my screen with you. And let's talk about what's your neighborhood like. Okay, so that means that you need to describe your neighborhood. You, neighbor, vecino. Neighborhood, vecindario. All right, that is your neighborhood. All right, sometimes you said neighbor, the place that you live, but no, that is your the, the person who lives in front of you, next to you, or behind. Oh, and also, guys, talking about that, we're also gonna going to make a refresh about the preposition, preposition of places, right? Okay, in front of, next to, behind, on, in, right? Across from all the stuff, everything we're going to learn, okay? Because it's really important, guys, for example, uh, when you go to, when you wanna give directions, you need to know that. Or for example, I don't know, Jenny or Steffi or Boris, or some of you guys uh, have a right to a specific place, but you don't know how to get to, to, to a, a situation, right? To a place. So you have to ask for directions. For ex yes, that had happens to me. When I don't know how to get to a specific place, I had to ask, hey, do you know about any chance where is the um, Plaza Merliot, for example? Where is it? Okay, you need to know how to give directions. Okay, so we're going to learn about this, this model because it's really important. Not only to ask, but also to give. So, because sometimes, guys, we ask for directions, right? But sometimes somebody else asks directions from us. So we need to also understand what they're asking or what they're talking about. But in this case, guys, before like practicing and give the whole sentence, we need to learn vocabulary. Vocabulary to construct the sentences. If we don't know the vocabulary, there is no way that we cannot construct our sentences, okay? So it's really important that we learn some vocabulary. So let me right now share my screen with you. And let me know if you see it. Can you see it, guys? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. All right, who can help me read the, qu the question? Thank you so much, uh, Boris. Go ahead. I did you, I knew it. The question. Yes, What's please. What's your neighborhood like? Uh -huh, very good, but a little bit more with question intonation, please. Go ahead. What's your neighborhood like? Very good. What's your neighborhood like? Excellent. Very good job. Okay, guys, in this place, or in this case, we're going to talk about different places. All right. Okay, let me share right now with you. Thank you, Boris. The first one. A, repeat after me, barbershop. Barbershop, barbershop. Uh -huh. Hey guys, what is in the Spanish barbershop? Any idea? Barberia, look at it. Yeah, yeah. Barberia. Barberia, yeah, barbershop, exactly. Okay, and um, what about grocery store? What's that? Venta de, mm. de productos. Yeah, you know what? Okay, yeah. let me, yes, let me go back to you because grocery yeah. store, it could be like a mini supermarket, for Una example. Barrotería. Exactly, it's like. like like this pencil of family are? Uh, I got it. Like that, like that, yeah. It's not yeah. a huge supermarket like uh, no, like Walmart. Market. Exactly, like when you can find a similar product for the supermarket, but it's a small place, okay? A small place. Oh, exactly, exactly. Let me go back to where we're, all righty. So repeat after me, grocery store. Grocery store. Very good. Okay, now the third one, laundromat. Laundromat. Any idea what's that? Laundria. Yeah, Laundria. exactly. Laundry. Yes, exactly. All right. Library. 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 What's that? La librería. No. Uh -huh. Libreria no. or biblioteca. What do you think? Library. Library. 
No, I, I'm just asking you. Uh -huh. What do you think? It's a, it's a library, yeah. All righty. No, library is biblioteca. Biblioteca, yes. 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 Bookstore. Bookstore, is, Bookstore is library, yeah. Exactly. Library. Yeah. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So library, biblioteca, right? Biblioteca. Okay, repeat after Bookstore. me. Library. 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 Okay, library. very, very good. Okay, number five, stationery store. Stationery store. Stationery store. Oh, stationery store. Stationery store. Stationery, no, stationery. Stationery store. Uh -huh. Stationery. Stationery. So what do you think is in a stationery store? I don't know. Any idea? I don't know, teacher. No, teacher. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. They use the, how would you say the Google? <laughs> oh, no, 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 don't say Google knows everything because not true. <laughs> oh my God. All right, a stationary store, guys. Uh, let me go back and let you know. The stationary store it is a store where you can find anything uh, related to, um, to paper things material for paper for example diseño diseño mm -hmm. that's that store that they like sells everything related to design papers different kind of colors different kind of sizes different kind of type of papers that like, is called uh, a stationary like store mm -hmm. office depot. Mm, it's, 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 no. not similar to office depot because office depot doesn't say yes. only paper it sells mm -hmm. uh, a no, it's, different it's, it's kind like of things a, it's like a diseño store. exactly like exactly store, okay. exactly that is a stationary store everything related mm -hmm. to paper stationary like papeleria like that right papeleria. exactly yeah. all righty also okay. you can find envelopes there right you can find ball paper like letter paper or something like that okay rims you know what rims or paper are rims mm -hmm. rims resmas rims Rims. Rims. Mm -hmm. Letter mm -hmm. paper is papel de carta. Letter paper. Carta. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if we have official paper, oficio. So, uh, All right. Letter yes. carta. carta. Official, oficio. Oficio. All right. Seal, sello. Seal. Legal is a little of. Uh, what? Legal is a little of. She's from England. Like, what? I, I, I don't get I don't yeah. get your, your question, Le Janet. Legal paper. Legal paper, legal yes. Paper. Yes, you can find a legal paper. Yes, exactly. Legal paper. Legal paper. Also, you can say it like that. You can say it either or. Okay, very good. Excellent. So now, guys, a new vocabulary for you. Stationary store, right? Stationary store. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, guys, let's continue. What about... Uh, repeat after me. Number six, theater. 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 No, not theater. 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 Very theater. good. That means? Theater. Yeah. Teatro. Very good. Travel agency. Travel, Travel agency. agency. Very good. Okay, guys. So basically, the, of course, right? You know that there are more places, but... We have chosen only seven today. So what I want you to, uh, to, we already identified the places. Now guys, in the second part, in my right side, it says it's a place where you, that means what, what can we find in that place? For example, wash and dry clothes. Where mm -hmm. we find that? Where? Three. Um. La in the laundry. laundry, yeah, laundry. in the laundromat. Okay, very good, excellent. All right, what about buy food? Where can we buy a food? Grocery store. Grocery store. Grocery store. The grocery store. Grocery store. Grocery store. Excellent. Grocery store. Okay, where can we buy cars and paper? Stationery store. Excellent. Stationary store. What about where can we get a haircut? Barbershop. 
Barbershop. Barbershop. Excellent. Barbershop. Very good. Where can we see a movie or play? Theater. 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 Let me ask you guys, do you know what's the meaning of play? Like a movie? And no. no. It's, uh, for example, cinema. Uh, cinema. A concert? And no. No. It's a theater. In, uh -huh. in, in Spanish, it's a. Teatro. Of teatro. course. Of course. Yes. In, but it says that in a theater, we can see a movie or play. So, in that context, what is the meaning of play? play? What is the meaning play. of play, guys? Play. Obra. Obra. Exactly. Obra de teatro. Very good. Exactly. Very good. What about make reservations for a trip? Where can we do uh, that? Uh, travel, travel agency. Travel, travel, agency. travel, travel agency. agency. Travel agency. Very good. And when can we borrow books? Borrow. The library. 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 Very good. Borrow. Prestar. Libro. Prestar. Borrow. Prestar. Okay. So repeat after me. Wash. 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 Uh -huh. Very good. Bye. 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 Get. 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 Make. 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 C. Z. Z. No, no Z as in, no, no Z. C. 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 Uh -huh. Very good. Borrow. Like, like C. Borrow. Borrow. Uh -huh. No, no like C. In Spanish, like C. Uh -uh. Because in Spanish we said C and that's it. C. But we mm -hmm. said C. This is a little bit longer, uh -huh. the pronunciation. A long, a long. A, a, a little bit, a little bit, Carlitos, because we have two E's together. So you said Z, C. 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 Uh huh. Borrow. Uh -huh. Borrow. Get. Borrow. Get. 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 Very good. Excellent. Bye. 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 Hey, remember bye. that we have two byes, right? Bye. Bye. bye, bye. Let's say bye, bye, bye. And then buy that you go bye. and buy something. Okay. So you see that pronunciation is kind of similar, but the second buy, you just pronounce it a little bit longer. Bye. 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 You see? Mm, you're different? You're longer, yes. Uh huh. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So bye. Then you're, bye. Exactly. So that's why I, we practice also the intonations. So you see, guys, it's really important. We're learning right now vocabulary, okay? So for example, if you can say in a barber shop, we can get a haircut, right? Okay, all right, mm -hmm. guys. Now do me a favor, because I'll give you already a material, but I just want to know, guys, uh, what will be your definition for these places? What do you think is a clothing store? What can we buy in a clothing store? Clothing store. Any for idea? Example, for example, in the shopping. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's all a clothing store. Uh huh. What, but what, uh, what, say, what can say we the, buy? Say the wearer, uh, top and underwear. Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay. So we can buy we can buy clothes, right? So. Okay. okay. What about drugstore? Drugstore. It's mm -hmm. like a it's a medicine. Uh-huh. Yes. Medicine. Okay. We can get medicine, right? Okay. What about internet cafe? Uh, it's uh, yes. It's a it co co internet cafe is a place mm. when there are many computer. Uh -huh. All people. All people. All people watch another internet or other guys in, in the computer. Uh huh. And also, use, you can, it fake, use it for the communication. For communication, for doing homework, right? As well. Yeah. Uh huh. For work. And at the same time, you can drink a cup of coffee, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, very good. Excellent. What about a music store? Any definition for music store, guys? Get a CD. Uh -huh. uh, sell CDs. Uh, Very good. Get CDs sold. What about Paz Office? Um, send send it's a, letter. Send a letter. Uh -huh. It's a place send where letter. you uh -huh, where you can what? Where you can get get as a verbo tener get 
where you can get what? Post office. Uh, post office. Letter. Um, uh huh. Or you can I get. Can send letter. Letter. You can send letters. You send can get. Letter. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. You can receive. Send packages. You can send receive and receive packages. I can send packages. Very good, Retain Carlitos. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. Uh, also in the post office, hey, you can also ask for seals. Well, you know what seals, seals are? Sedges? Sí. Oh, yeah? Oh, uh, seals. Very okay. good. Yeah. Excellent. All righty. Estampillas, ¿cómo se dice? How you say estampillas in English? Any idea? Stamps. 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 Stamps? Are you sure? No. I, know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. Yes, I know. No, stamps are sellos. Mm -hmm. How you say estampillas? Any idea? No. Nope. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. Teacher. You can you know that? Uh-huh. Have you heard have you have you heard that before? No? Mm -hmm. Stamps. 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 Yes, but you can also say it in a different way. You can say uh, a postage stamp. Stamp. Or postage. What? Postage stamp. Postage. Postage mm -hmm. stamp. Mm -hmm. Postage stamp. Postage. Let me write it to you. Postage stamp. Stamp. There you go. That that means estampilla postal. Passage stamp. Okay. That's another way. So Good, that, night, you Good night. Good night, Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, my, my, yeah, your my daughter. daughter, your daughter yeah. That's okay. Okay, you see, guys, you have you have learned uh, different words today. Isn't it amazing? Wow. Okay, guys, very good. All right, excellent. So do me a favor. That is going to be your homework for tomorrow, teacher. Again, yes. Like okay, like the same thing that we have done today. For example, you said a clothing store. It's a place where you can buy clothes. For example, right? Okay, so I want you guys to think about three places, but don't tell us the name of the place. You just tell us what you can find there. For example, it's a place where you can get your pet's food, for example. Sorry. Yeah? No, that's okay. No, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> I'll stay here with you guys. <laughs> All right, please don't go, don't go. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I give you an idea, right? So imagine, guys, mm -hmm. if I'm saying it's a place where you can get your pet's food, what do you think am I talking about? What place I'm talking about? Pet store. It's a pet store. Oh. Exactly, exactly. Or it's a it's a place where you can mm. a, a, when somebody can check your pet's health. Uh, veterinary. 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 Yes, very good. Veterinary office. Okay, very good. Excellent. So you see, okay, I don't want you guys to let me know the place. I want you guys to give me the definition of the place. So I think only three, mm -hmm. three, three, three places. Think about three places or three definitions uh, per per you. So three, Jan and three Carlitos, Antonio and three Carlitos Cruz and so on. And tomorrow, the first thing that we're going to do is that you're going to let us know, everybody. Hey, guys. Hey, guess, guess which place am I talking about? It's a place where, and everybody has to guess, for example, what is the first place that Carlito is letting us know? In this time, guys, it will help us because um, we're going to increase our vocabulary, okay? That's what I want. And of course, everybody will be participating. But, but, it's, it's, but think about, guys, 
uh, the name of the place that is near your neighbor, right? Near your neighborhood. For example, um, you can also, how you say ferretería? How you say that in English? I'm not going to let you know. <laughs> how you said, for example, um, panaderia? Bakery. How you, ah, wait a minute. How you say pasteleria and panaderia? That's two things. Different. Ketchup. I don't know. Ketchup. I don't know. Brand. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not yeah. going to let you know. Uh -huh. It could be. Yeah, it could be. I'm not going to let you know. Uh -huh. So you said, for example, salchonineria. <laughs> Sal no, salcho no. What's the name of that in the Spanish? Salchichoneria. That, okay, that's how you say that. How you said carnizaria, right? How you said when you buy only milk products like cream like uh like cheese like butter no better butter butter right b-u-t-t-e-r butter how you say that in english aha uh -huh, you see that will increase our vocabulary imagine the teacher give you all the vocabulary no way no way <laughs> with me you study you learned. And the only way to learn <laughs> is to search for that information. Yeah, you will never forget that. I promise. Okay, guys, any doubts, any questions that you might have so far? No. Hey, hey, I, I sent it to you another song. How was the song practice? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> nobody has listened to that song, right? No. <laughs> no? Well, hopefully you can do it on the, um, on weekend. On weekend? Yes, on weekend. And because by next week, I'm going to send it to a hotter song. Yes, and it was the same. Yeah, it's by like Gloria Rayner. That would be a really nice song. It calls I Will Survive. It too. I Will Survive. I will Don't worry, I will send you plenty of them. <laughs> Eo, you, you want to say something about the songs? Go ahead. Uh, <laughs> He's the only one that I heard it. I'm just kidding. No, it is a good exercise. Yes, it is. It is really good exercise. Yeah, in fact, um, I learned English singing a song. Yes, it's really nice. It's very interesting, not only by the pronunciation because of the listening part as well and the intonation. So yes. please do it. I'm not uh, uh, giving you that information just to waste time uh, for you to have fun. Yes, of course you have fun with the music, right? Yeah, but the purpose is that you practice the intonation and the speaking. That's the purpose. I'm not asking you, please sing the song for us. No way. Well, if you want to, we can sing a song together. That would be not a problem at all. Uh, Janet will be perfectly 100% agree. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't worry. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to make you uh, sing. Okay, don't worry. Well, maybe I, maybe I will. I know. I recognize <laughs> it. <laughs> maybe I will. Maybe I will. <laughs> no, yeah. I'm, just, I'm just teasing you. But you know what? Ah, oh my goodness, the teacher has, it's a Pandora box, right? My, my brain, you cannot mm -hmm. imagine. It's a Pandora box. Oh, well, basically, mm -hmm. you know what? Uh, I, I'm thinking about a really good exercise. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, Eo, mm -hmm. don't, don't worry, Eo. But I think you, you, you maybe guess what I'm going to come up with, right? The maybe. evil brain. Yeah, Boris, the evil English brain. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I will. I will let yeah. you know. Uh, maybe on tomorrow. Okay. Ma maybe I said maybe. Okay. <laughs> Very evil. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Everybody's like, oh my god, teacher. Oh yeah. I think I, I. 
You I see, will. you know? <laughs> and, and, and Jen is like itching, like, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I think Even my maybe lap is I will like... not be on the class. <laughs> uh, really? Okay. It's up to you. No, but I'll say tomorrow we'll give you the instruction. I'm not saying that you will do something. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay. I, I hopefully, guys, you will have a pretty good dream today. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. My laugh is like creepy. Like, <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, yes, that's what my niece said. Teacher, is, she said, Auntie, what? Sometimes you laugh at such a creepy way. Really? Like, oh, 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 oh. like she's, that's what she said. Like, oh, yeah, I don't know why. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you so much for being one more class. Tomorrow is our last class for this week, okay? Please don't miss it. I wish you a really great night, and I'm in it. <laughs> Hugs and kisses. Okay. Bye, guys. Bye. Take care. Bye. 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 Bye.